Hello guys and welcome back to my vlog. So why do I look weird? Hold on girl. Okay, I think this coloring looks a little bit better, but today is gonna be a laid back, normal, errand type of vlog, Not nothing exciting going on. But Steven is at work and I have a lot of errands to do. I have a lot of laundry to do. I have a lot of homework to do. And so yeah, I'm gonna get my day started. I'm wearing this little shirt with shorts and then I'm gonna wear white sneakers, but I have to go to a good amount of places, but I'm probably gonna end up going to one because I'm gonna give up. But before I go, I know I'm getting it hungry because it is currently 11.36 and have not eaten anything, so I'm gonna have this chicken noodle soup, which looks delicious, girl. I fixed up my hair a little. I put it in like a slip back bun, and I ended up wearing these sandals, which I get made fun of for wearing these all the time, but I think they're so comfortable and cute. But I forgot to mention, I'm dog sitting. It's my best friend, you know Melissa, her mom's dog. And they all went to New York for their cousin's wedding, so they're probably having so much fun. So I'm dog sitting. So this is Mimi. Hi, Mimi. Say hello. Hello, Mimi. But my cat Jonah does not like her. He literally like doesn't want anything to do with her, but she like wants to play with them. So it's kind of funny to watch. So I got Steven these dress shoes from boohoo.com, but he did not like them, which I don't blame him because they are very pointy in the front. So first I'm going to TJ Maxx, but then after that, I'm going to the post office because I have to return these before it's too late. But to be honest, I have no idea how to do that. So hopefully I figure it out. Let's go. So I'm at TJ Maxx and I'm doing a little bit of damage. Look at all the stuff I have to try on, but look at this chair. It's so cute. I want it so bad. Look how cute this chair is. Oh my gosh, I want it so bad. Ah, this is adorable. I know I shouldn't get it, but I want it and it's so fluffy. I'm in the fitting room now and I'm gonna try on all of these clothes and hopefully they all work. Actually, hopefully they don't because then I don't have to spend money. But that's okay. Ow, 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 ow. No, no, no. Okay, okay. Okay, nope, nope, still. I am at Ulta now and I can't decide which concealer shade to get. I swatched them all in my hand, it's kind of hard to tell. But I have no idea which one looks best, so I'm waiting for them to dry to figure out. But I literally want everything in here. I'm at Publix now because I'm here to get sugar because I really want to make sweet tea. Got the good good. Now I'm gonna try to look around and see if they have like a pitcher because I need a pitcher to like pour the sweet tea in. And TJ Maxx sadly did not have one, so hopefully they have one here. Nope. No pitcher here, sadly. Why? to the post office so let's get this over with I got my package and I got my return label officially done that was really confusing I have no idea what I just did I'm pretty sure I got charged for something that I should have gotten charged from but you know what? I don't even care because I just want to go home so see you at home okay guys so I'm back from running my errands and I'm gonna be showing you guys what I got but if you know me I mm. This camera needs to focus on me. But if you know me, you know I literally live in active wear and so I just needed a whole new wardrobe of active wear because everything was cotton. So every time like I washed it, it got like really like gross. So I thought it was time to get more active wear stuff. So the first thing I got was this sports bra, which I thought was so cute. Next, I got this one, which I thought this print was adorable. I'm not going to go into too much detail because there will be a separate video and there'll be like a try on part if you want to see more of those sports bras. Next, I got a white um, activewear tank. 
I thought this one was super cute. Next, I got these pants. I have been loving these like loose type pants, but these are kind of different because it has a waistband right there. I don't know if you can tell, but the bottom, it's a little bit tighter at the bottom and it doesn't go all the way down. It like stops at the ankle and it has two pockets and they have pockets on the booty too. So you know, girl, you know what's up. And lastly, focus on me. I got this maxi dress which i thought was adorable it's just navy blue white striped and it's kind of like a high neck and it's very flowy which i like but it's also tight on the booty which i like and then this is literally bittersweet i thought these little things would be so cute for when i have a house and they were only 2.99 like yes girl it has like a copper lid and i thought these were adorable to put like noodles, rice, flour, whatever. So I was like, okay, they had so many different sizes. So I was like, okay, like I'll get like a small, medium, and large. But I'm so sad because just keep watching. I have the large and I have the medium. And when I got out of the car, the small one broke, it fell. And I'm literally so sad. Like the glass fell and broke and I literally, I just got it and it broke. So I have to get a new one of these. If you can tell, it wouldn't look like that. So now I can't use this, but I'll definitely have to go pick up one of those small ones again. And I don't know, I like buying house stuff even though I don't have a house. And then I went to Ulta and I got some goodies there. So let me show you that. First things first, I needed a new beauty blender, like so bad because mine was disgusting. So I got that. I got some Ardell Wispies. At Target, they never have these. They have Demi Wispies and they're not the same. So I got one of those. I got the Tarte Shape Tape Concealer, which I have been so excited about and I've been wanting for a very long time. So I finally got it. Oh my God, that was broke. So here it is and I got it in the shade medium. And that is it for my mini haul in a vlog. I've never done that, but first time for everything. Okay, so I changed my shirt because this one's more comfortable and I'm wearing like kid Pajama bottoms, but I don't give two sh So first things first, you're gonna need some Lipton iced tea bags. This is the family bags size. So usually I use two tea bags for that. And then if they're not family size, use four. Then I get a pot and I fill it up with water. I kind of just fill it up until you realize it's probably gonna overflow. Then you carefully take this without spilling it. You put it on the stove. I usually put it on high so that it can boil. And then you take your two tea bags and you throw them in. Just kidding, that's not how you do it. Don't do it that way. Okay, let's do this right. You have to unravel a tea bag and then you just place it in and make sure this little thing is outside of it. And then once it starts boiling, you let it boil from three to five minutes and then you take it out of the stove. And then what I like to do is get your pitcher. This is my ghetto pitcher because it's not a pitcher, but this is what I'm gonna use. And while that's boiling, I get my sugar. I use two and a half cups of sugar and I put it at the bottom of this so that when the hot tea gets poured into the pitcher, it all melts nicely. So let's do that while that's boiling. Look who came to visit. It's not a vlog if Benny's not in it. Say hello. Once you pour in the tea, you take cold water and you fill up the rest of the gallon with water. So I changed outfits again because I'm about to film a video. The cat and the dog is fighting behind me, but here is a sweet tea. Mmm, yes, honey. <laughs>